The battle's lost if they've made it this far. But maybe I can still take out an officer or two. I guess now you're the one who's messing up all of my clever plans. Hey, I just work here. You're gonna make a nice trophy for the Emperor. Never too late to do the right thing, Ignaz. Come back to us. Stop trying to sway me, Claude. Now it is my turn. It's not going to work. Lord, can't you just play nice until I achieve what I set out to do? Funny. I was going to ask you that. But I'm guessing the answer is the same for both of us. Now, let us bring it down! I'm sad it's come to this, Lawrence. And yet, even as you speak those words, you seek an opening to strike at me. I know you well, Claude. They've got me cornered. Better think fast. That's all I can take. Let's see if our new mercenary friend is worth all that gold. I'm sorry, Claude. They were too much for us. It's all right, Hilda. Well, it's not, but I knew this was a possible outcome. I was hoping the terrain might let us hold, but against that many soldiers deployed that skillfully, it just wasn't enough. You sound sad. It's a little weird. Can you blame me? Look at how many people have died because I decided to fight this war. <sighs> Maybe I should have just let the Empire have their way. My father and the others never would have accepted that. You had to throw everything you had at the enemy at least once, or they think you were a coward forever. Wow, Hilda. I didn't think you'd picked up on all of that. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Too bad everything I had still wasn't enough. Well, the next step is to put our heads together and figure out what to do next. I hope you don't mind if I lean on you and that brother of yours for support. Lester's roundtable is overdue for some big changes.